Hello, everybody, and welcome back to a nice bit of the old Snake Pit Plays. You, you sound like a rapist. Because when it gets me to this game, I get all spicy. You want to spice out. Spicy. And spice down. Just what are we playing, Cade? We are playing, um, definitely joint, if not flat out, my favorite game literally ever. Ooh, big and plays. I'll be wanking on about this game for years to the point where anybody who knows me even reasonably well is fucking bored of hearing me talk about it. <laughs> and yet, we're going to help here. Oh, 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 yeah, we are. I will keep us bored we're and, gonna, we're gonna and watch check. Because this, this is beautiful. Bam, 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 Bigelow. It's Troubles. Pray. This is like my favorite intro sequence ever. It's Four so, answers. Like, it's like minimalist, but cinematic. Chicka, 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 chicka. What's the helicopter carrying? I don't know. What's this? It's a big foot. It's a very big foot made of metal. Metal dicks. They're putting metal awesome. dicks in this big foot. Look at all these... We have all the panels and if you didn't know robots and like fighting max suits are Cade's porn. Oh, <laughs> well you look at that now. Needs Isn't a helicopter a to lift up its gun. gun. Some little blast back panels. It's good times. He raped click, it. Click this big some bitch on. Get ready to launch. Got to got to lock in those accelerators. Oh. 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 Buckle up, son. Oh yeah. Boosters. It's variable. <laughs> it's variable. <laughs> I'm getting happy. He's dropped his balls. <laughs> oh. The best balls in the world. Wait for it. Wait it, for it. It doesn't get better than this. It does not get better than a missile that turns into more missiles. It's beautiful. Oh, what's that? Ba -ba -ba -ba. Fuck all y'all. <laughs> get out of here. That is animated beautifully. Isn't it, though? It's from soft, though, so... You wish games could look like this all the time. It's from not soft, just so you know. You, you hey, know look, that's familiar. <laughs> hey, y'all may have seen this before. Oh, oh, oh! Sometimes you catch one. That's just how it goes. You catch Sometimes a helicopter, you wreck a helicopter and kill them. He's killed those guys. Oh yeah. Oh oh oh! He's doing the thing. That's a very big walkie tank. Oh. Using his bank high. We are going to play Armored Core for answer. A, and just after I wipe name. up a little mess. Um, <laughs> it's a dumb if name. Anyone has a Kleenex. Armored Core for for answer, but Armored Core for answer. Storage device. Copyright ninety seven. Yep. Whatever. Standard regs because we don't need to be playing them games. Come on, new game, new game. We're doing it. It's on. Checking free space. There ain't there's, much. But there's enough. <laughs> it doesn't require much. It's in the... It's it's few enough that it's measured in kilobytes. My armpits smell funny. Game settings. DR is fine. Jump the music up a bit because it's actually gorgeous. And probably take the sound effects down a tad just because... It wanna... won't make any difference. Probably not all that much, no. But I like having a bit of a focus on the music. They won't hear it. Because I am a hard gush for this game. <laughs> He's yeah, gushing all I, over the place. The thing is, I know it's there. <laughs> it's for me. I know. Uh, it's, yeah, it's regular A for me. And we take <laughs> Already all the assists off. Already playing with settings. <laughs> Rosenthal. <laughs> Rosenthal. So, the setting for this game, this is actually a sequel in the series uh, to Armored Core 4, just normal Armored Core 4. 
and uh, not really great with explaining too much, but that's kind of a FromSoft thing. So we're going to learn about what an AC can do. It can move. It can right. certainly uh, it can certainly do a run. It can get to a good clip, a jog and all. <laughs> Turn your easy. AC three Turn times. It. Turn it. Turn it again. Just your view. On, down, up, down. Fuck's up. sake. Certain Reset. things just bam, don't bam, need bam. to be said. It's done. All right. Great. Sorry. There's a couple of little bits. And it's good just to like establish what the actual capabilities of these are. So this is boost movement. Fuck you, red circle. You piece of shit. Oh, Going to you, going round your ass. Yeah, fuck off. Thinks he's Michael Jackson on stage. Where is the next target anyway? <laughs> he's lost already. It's on top of that building. Oh, no. oh, almost. He did it. No, he didn't. What the fuck's wrong with you? Such physics. Physics. It's a little bit funny with like jumping and landing and stuff. Quick boost. Quick boost is good. Quick boost is this guy. Pyong. Pion. 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 And quick boost in any direction at any time and you spam the shit out of it. Go fast. Over over boost. Boost. Over boost is a thing that nobody ever uses. Because it's dumb. But it, it makes, makes an F1 a noise. Fucking F1 noise. And it wants me to use it three times, which is amazing. Meow. So we just do that. And, Pion. Yeah. and you can keep it going for quite a while. You can also go aerial when you're doing it too. It makes you go a little faster. But it also drains the shit out of your energy, and it drains the, like, bar next to my, like, HP total at the top. Attack basics. Use gun to kill mains. Gun kills the mans. Boom. Boom. And left gun kills the other mans. Correct. We learned how to kill some mans. It's good. Switching weapons. Well, so that locks out between your right arm and your right shoulder. And then between your left arm and your left shoulder. Big old laser cannon. Okay. Hooray. There we go. So that's the thing. Now you know how an armor core is set up. Sort of. Weapon types. So rifles go bang. Lasers go pew Lasers pew. go pion. Laser blades go fuck you. Missiles go pew 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 pew. Missiles go multi-target the fuck out of this shit. Finished. Pretty insane with the whole missile spray there. And then there's like your fifth slot, which is your shoulder weapons, which is usually like small kind of missiles. Like just kind of like small disposable little one shot things. Uh, flares also tend to fit into that slot as well, which are very fucking useful. Assault armor wasn't included in uh, main armor core 4, but it allows me to do this. <laughs> Fuck off! It's a fuck off. Fuck off. <laughs> it's a real just like, go fuck yourself. But that does drain uh, the shield bar. Uh, well, it's got to have some drawback. Well, it's literally assault armor. It's it's using your defenses as an offense. Almost there. Uh, you can do it any time it's white. You don't have to wait for it to go all the way back up. And just for you. Missiles! <laughs> a little practice battle where we just shoot down some choppers. So here we go. This is nice. It's like it's like putting on a very comfortable old jumper for me. That's a sweater for you Americans. Tutorials really should be optional. Like, you should be able to skip them. Yeah. <laughs> In this case, I really don't need one. Enter pilot name. And now. I am. Cad. So you said she no say. Okay. So, I'm going to start by picking who we're going to kind of align ourselves with. So it's not like necessarily a choice of pathing through the game, but it does dictate what you're starting. Describe so, them in one, one sentence only. Um, General Arms America, that's a sunshine. It's big. And tanky, and it likes bazookas and chain guns and dumbness. Uh, Interior Union is kind of an energy frame. It's all for kind of lasers and plasma shit and nice high energy output. Um, 
Omer's, that is uh, Hogire, and it's more focused on like speed and ballistic based weaponry, so it's kind of a rifle hound. And if you go independent, <coughs> you get to use the Alia, which is uh, kind of one of the poster boys and is very much uh, sort of balanced, but with quite the focus on speed. Tank, laser, rifle, emo. Got it. Yeah. Um, so I'm actually going to not do what I normally do, and I'm going to go independent here. Normally, I pick this bitch because I love those bastards. But I'm going to put myself out of my comfort zone a little bit. Isn't he emo, fellas? Yeah. It's Ali. It's all spiky and looks like a jet plane. Ah, uh, yeah. More than ten years have passed since the National Dismantlement War. Do I know that voice? League of Corporations has Feels like you should, right? The world. It sounds like Leonardo Liquid Snake. I think it sounds like a mix between um, Cam Clark and Troy Baker. Sounds like Cam Clark to me. It's gotta be Cam Clark. I'm pretty sure it is. It sounds just like him. It, I, it's, it's subtly different. Subtly. <coughs> mm, coughing all over the joint. So the Earth has poisoned and fucked, and there was a whole big war about it, which was focused on in Armour Core 4. Right. And the Nexts, which are like the big complex bipedals that we pilot, were very sort of pivotal in that as kind of like mercenary forces. And what, on the conclusion of the war, they just sort of left us on the poisoned planet as a no longer particularly particular necessary kind of element. That's nice. That was very nice of them. And so now the actual surface of the Earth is a bit of a sort of mercenary's heaven. Outer heaven. So we're going to go fight Lionheart because we're dicks. Let's go be dicks. Lionheart kind of ended up being the good guys of AC4. It's like a... Yeah, anti-establishment forces. So it's kind of like a, a, a little haven of independence on the planet not reliant on the League. Who are all floating around in their big fucking hundred thousand population sky fortresses away from the pollution and all of the problems. Oh, everyone's got problems. They don't have to cry about it. They'll cry babies. White fucking glint, though. That's that chappy from the intro. And luckily, he's. Yeah, the white glint is like Line Arc's trump card. And since we're attacking Line Arc, it's good to know that the glint is not going to be there. Because <laughs> we'd have fucking troubles, let me tell you what. Go kill mans. So it's nice, it's good. It's good. Right. Right then. He's so, got a right nerdy face. Look at his tiny head on top, just like, all right, guys. He's got a proper beanie little head. All right, there. However, both shoulder slots support a single weapon. Like, it takes up both of the shoulder slots. Because it's like the biggest cannon you've ever seen in your life. Spray them Spray with bullets. Fuck you. Fuck all of you. They MTs. are well shit. They should all be fired. They are hammy little MTs. Nobody gives a fuck. They are what scrubs pilot. They are the fucking squishy mortal human things. Shaking off the rust. Oh yeah. Not really, mate. Yep, primal armor. No. So anytime anybody makes reference to primal armor, that's just the the shield bar I was talking about next to my health there. So it's kind of like three classifications of mech. I feel bad for them. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> I've, I've never. But they're just like, oh my god, we're we're getting genocide. Will no one help us? So yeah. There you go, that's it. Mission one over. <laughs> well, I was it, expecting a little more. Very, like, the missions are very short and quickly resolved for the most part. 
I see. So up here, it, it just looks like a tech demo. It breaks up very nicely. Fucking line arc. Time to bounce. Crazy shit. Time to bounce in game. Time to bounce in real life. Ryan Kess, he starts on a high, but if he'd got anything less, I proper would have ripped him. He would have too. So, until next time, I've been Kof. I've been Kate. And we will shoot more Robotmans next time. I'm sorry.